Hello, Shadowcat back with more Hammer Ting. So, let's get into it. <clears throat> because, well, we have... I'm not exactly sure what I'm doing today. There's several things that we need to do. But I'm not exactly sure how I'm going to go about this. I guess I'm just going to take it one at a time, to be honest. So, first things first, I finished the scaffold down here. So, we are ready to start harvesting iron. Which is good, because we're going to need iron. So, right off the bat... There's some iron there. There's... Uh, wait, no, not that. <laughs> don't don't dig out the whole cliff. <laughs> no. No, no, no. But do get the iron. So there we go. We do that. We get lots of iron. We're good. For a while, at least. There's also lots of shiny stuff up here, too, that we should probably be getting. And I don't know if we can. But you know what? I'm going to uh, mark it. And if someone can get it, great. If they can't get it, then they can't get it. You know, no big deal. No big deal. It's like this over here. Uh, can they get this? No. But could they get this if we did this? Eh? Yeah, just like that. See? He knows what's up. Kinda. Uh, other things that we need to get done. I thought about making more of these these uh, small smithies. And then I realized that, you know, we have small quarries. And we got a big quarry. And we also have a small foundry. But then we got a big foundry. So I'm wondering if we have a small smithy, if we're going to get, like, a bigger one at some point... So I'm waiting for that. Another thing we have a problem with over here is our dwarves. So dwarves have uh, an aspect called greed. And it's because of this greed that they're, they, they're happy? I don't know. I'm not exactly sure what greed is or how it works or what it does. But I do know that they have a need for coins. So, right now, we don't have any. Like, it's all gone. We need to do some trading. Otherwise, we're just going to have unhappy dwarves all over the place. And you guys have the mission, the lumber trade. Right now, I can't afford anything. Now, one of the things that I've heard sells really well, and I may get to work on that down here, are pillars. And they seem to work pretty well in the past. So let's make 10 pillars. We already had three, so we're just going to make sure that we're up to 10. And we'll sell pillars to whomever we can get to buy them. That should bring in some. Ingva, what are you doing? I don't know. So that's another thing. We will get as much coin as we can, and we'll try to make our dwarves happy. The other thing is research. We've got 49 of both mountain and trade lore. What can we get with this? So tier 1 done, tier 2, tier 3, everything's done. And we may as well go for tier 4. So we can get brewing, established authority, geological surveys, and machinery. Now machinery sounds like the most fun. Geological surveys seems like the most practical. Established authorities will let us build a great hall. And that sounds cool. And brewing just seems mandatory because dwarves. So what do we do? Um, I can get two of them as long as it's not geological surveys and machinery. So I think what we're going to do is we're going to get geological surveys and the established authority. Yeah, I think I like that. Because the geological surveys will let us get more mountain lore, I think. Now, what can we build? A great hall. Oh my god! It's enormous. Where are we even going to fit this thing?
Um, well, we can't put it between here. That's not going to work. Maybe over here? I think so. Maybe we just go one, two, three. So we have room for a door. And we just put the Great Hall over here. That'll get us expanding over in this other direction, too. And I like this idea. Oh, wait. I went over too far. Okay. Um, um, um. We can fix this. Okay. So we do that. Now we just need to replace the Great Hall. There we go. And there's still a gap up here, so if we expand this any further, we'll be fine. We're gonna have a frozen Great Hall. Kinda, I guess. I mean, there's nothing wrong with that. We can have a frozen Great Hall. And the Geological Survey. How do we do that? Is that something we do here? No, because this is the infirmary. Up here? Yes, a land survey. We've also got um, these dwarven maps, and I'm not sure what we do with them. But you know what? Let's let's do a geological survey. Or a land survey, or whatever. Oh, we need the map for this. So we need parchment for a map. We need a map for a survey. Interesting. In the meantime, where are you at? Okay, so Unar. And you know what? You know what? While we're here. So I got a comment. Somebody likes this game. However, they didn't say they wanted to be a dwarf. But I'm going to take advantage of this anyway, because this, this is unpronounceable. What even is this? Unar? Unar? Is the U silent? Are the N silent? Is the R silent? I don't know. You know what? I'm done with it. You're now Ron. Thank you, Ron. You have saved my sanity single-handedly. So congratulations, Ron. Now, actually, you do need to level up. So, you have all of this stuff already. Where is... You are robust and aware. Robustness is over here on the steel path. So there we go. You're going to be moving towards the steel path. Of course, that put or gave you more awareness. So now I guess we go either way. Maybe towards the exquisite palette? I don't know. I guess we'll find out later. And in the meantime, how are we doing on pillars? We have lots of pillars. All right, we need to trade with someone. We need to we need to give the dwarves something to be greedy over. So, let's see. Granite pillars, 36. But does it matter? Can you get different amounts for uh, from different settlements? Ooh, you can. You guys sell for 37. Interesting. 32. So I gotta pay attention to just who I'm selling it to. Oh, wow. There's so many of these. You know what? I'm not gonna go through all of them. It's too much work. Norrington, you can have them. I'll sell you all of those. So what do you need over here? We need ingots and we need slabs. They're doing a good job of digging it out, though. And look at what we've uncovered. I was kind of worried that we would uncover something, but this this is okay. This will be fine. We are going to need to build up a, uh, a floor, though. So I'll extend it out that far. That should give us room to put a door on the other side. Go, dwarves, go! And try not to fall down in there. You fell down in there. Well, at least you can still get out. How's everyone else doing? Eh, we're doing fine. 
We do still have a lot of stuff over here, so we need crab broth, we need algae pancakes. And you know what? I think I saw a crab over here somewhere. But I don't know if he's still there anymore, or if I can even get to him. Was it in here? It might have been in here. Yeah, there's a crab over here. I need to see if I can get him. I don't know if I can. Or how I would even go about that, because that is a big lake. It's a big lake. I don't know. We'll work on that. How are we doing over here? We got everything mined out, so that's good. There's more of these fungus things over here. Let's get these cleaned out as well. I don't care what you do with them, just cut them down. And there's coal in the walls. So go ahead and mine some of that out. You guys like mining. You're dwarves. Everyone likes to mine. Is there anything else we can do? So we still need that large vault, but that's not coming for a very long time. Uh, Ancient Omen. Discover God of the Forge. I don't know what that is. Wall fluid source found. Now you keep saying this, but I never know what you mean by it. What is this? More coal? Uh, okay. More coal is cool. They're getting the floor put in. What are you doing? Stop that. Stop that. Stop that. No, just move. Stop. Stop jumping. Stop jumping. I don't know how to fix you. You're broken. I don't... Stop. Please. Okay, he's moved on. I guess he was just doing side-to-side -side jumps for reasons? Is he the Saitama Dwarf? I don't know. What is this? A Sapphire Crab. Ooh. Can anyone get that? No, no one can get that. Interesting to know, though. We could continue digging this out, though. We could dig this tunnel over until we were in. Maybe. Maybe not. We'll, we'll see. Now, one of the things I wonder about is, did we ever make that land survey? No, we did not. Why didn't we? Is it just because you're busy with other things? Wait, you've already... The Dwarven map is gone, so maybe you have? I don't know. It's so hard to tell. You're working in the farm. You guys are working up there. No one's working down here for some reason. We have granite pillars. Okay. Uh, Norrington, are you still buying granite pillars? Yes, but only for 34 now. Is there someone else who will buy them? Oh, we also have copper tools that we can get rid of. And silver? Wait, is this really what we should be using our silver for? Oh well, you know what? Just sell that copper stuff. Uh, okay. So apparently the exclamation point means they have a high demand for it. Does that mean that they'll pay more for it? Maybe. So maybe that's what we should do. We should go just go through here and look for exclamation points. Any more? Yeah, granite pillar. Ooh, for 73 a pop. Yeah, sell them those. Moten Beam is started somewhere. Someone got attacked by a rat. I'm not even going to look. Yeah, that doesn't tell me anything. Moten Beam. Who is started for Moten Beam? Is it you guys? You're new. Yes. Okay. Go deliver them some beams and I guess a block of brand is a moat. I don't know. It's all weird words and concepts I don't entirely understand and it makes me angry. Also says I need copper. 
And it, it really is specific about the whole copper thing. So, yeah. Um, I do not want you to repeat this, but I do want you to make some copper. And we're paused. Why are we paused? No, get going. All right, so now we're getting copper, and it should get delivered down here, I hope. You better not be using that copper to build stuff. Oh, never mind. We're working. Yes? Yeah, here it comes. Yes! Show me the Great Hall. What is that? Is that a giant head? <gasps> it's done. That's the Great Hall. Oh, this is awesome. Look at the dwarves on either side. Giant axes. Oh, this is cool. So, like, what do it do? Is there anything we can do? It's a place for gathering for all occasions in the mountain home. The Great Hall is universally used for recurring conclaves among the clan or colony elders known as the Ting, where the ancient dwarven custom of the Hold's autocracy is expressed. I have no idea what that even means, but it's cool, and I love it. And we have... 39 lore. Can we get something else? Um, we can, actually. We can get both of these, actually. We can get brewing and machinery. Cool. So, for brewing. Do we get anything new? A brewery. Of course we get a brewery. Why wouldn't we? What else would we get? Alright, so we're going to put it right down here. This looks good. We'll go, uh, one... Two, three. That looks perfect right there. And we'll make sure to... Ooh, we got rails. Okay, hold on. We'll put the door right there. And we'll get to work on that. And we'll also need to extend this out. So that we can get another dwelling in here. Although we have plenty of dwellings. We're out of money already? How do we run out of money? We just had a whole bunch of money. All right. You, what do you want to buy? Is there anything you want to buy? A gold hewing spear? Really? Please, stop using gold for making tools. I also heard somewhere that you can actually, maybe this is my problem, you can actually set it to where it will use a certain type of Yes, you can. Okay, so if I tell it to use the Restless Bones, maybe it will use the Restless Bones. Yeah, uh, I've been learning a few things between episodes, but I still feel like I know absolutely nothing about this. So that'll be the brewery. We'll let them do that. And in the meantime, we have carts and tracks. Okay, what do we even do with this stuff? Elevator rails. Interesting. So how should we do this? First off, where can we put rails? Can we put rails in front of things? Uh, rail station, rails... This is elevator rails, though. Can they just roll the carts across the ground, then? Is that how that works? I don't know if that's how that works. If that is how that works... Can I just put a cart there? Rail station. I don't know what to do with this. So, I mean, what does a rail station do? 
Uh, rail stations are the beginning and end points. Okay, I see. Beginning and end points for rails. Where carts can switch between traveling along horizontal railways and vertical ones. Okay, okay. Um. Um. What? Well, I think we need one anyway. And I think that I'm going to go ahead and put a rail station... You know what? I'm going to put a rail station over here. That's what I'm going to do. So I want to go ahead and put a door here. And I don't know if that matters or not. But I'll put a door there, and I'm going to put a, a rail station. We're learning as we're going here. Oh, and the brewery's done. Amazing. Cool. Okay. So, I want to have alcohol. Now, for this, we need water and grain. For this, we need water and honey. And I think, I think, we're already doing both of those. Are we? Yes. Yes, we are. So, we already have everything we need. And we can start building the, uh, or we, we can start making alcohol. Fantastic. Now, as for trade, what else can we sell? You guys want granite blocks. Sure, have some. Is there anything else you want? Oh, and before anything else, you did stop making copper, didn't you? Yes, yes you did. Wait, I thought I turned that off before. Okay, so I guess now we're no longer making infinite copper. Maybe we ran out of copper ore. That wouldn't be the worst thing. Speaking of ore, did you guys ever get this mined out? Yes, yes you did. And then you left all the iron down here, I think. Yeah, you left all the iron ore down here. I don't blame you, though. I mean, it's cold down here. Who wants to stay down here? So how are we doing? Wait, we need track sections? Machine parts and granite slab. Okay. So. The, the foundry. We need to make some stuff. Okay. Machine parts need sheet metal. Which we've got. Yeah, we do have metal sheets. Okay, so let's make three of those. And track sections require granite slabs and ingots. We'll make three of those as well. And then, I'm not exactly sure how this is going to work. But we'll have to wait until we get this one done, I think. And I'm hoping that maybe I can bring this all the way up. And it'll be the same size, roughly, as these? Not quite, but by the time I bring it up, it'll be able to fit under underground. Yeah, because it'll have to come up right here. We go up, 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 up. Yeah. yeah, plenty of room. Plenty of room. And then I guess they can just move uh, the carts along here, maybe? And hopefully, if I don't have to lay down track, I can just make stops on every level and people can move carts as they need to. I think. I'm not positive on this one. It's kind of confusing. I do also wonder what's down here. Perhaps I should send someone to go look. I keep getting distracted by everything I need to be doing. So, Ron, I kind of have a task for you. Can you come over here and look at this? Look down here. Ron? Wait, Ron, come down here. Wait, you can't. 
Someone's being attacked by a fat rat. Well, they were being attacked by a fat rat. It's gone now. Alright, so you can't get over here, actually. But we came through and we did this. Oh, wait. You know what? I wouldn't want you to anyway. We need to clear out this tangled hollow. And you guys can get down here. I believe you can climb up as well. So if we just dig this away, like that, that should open all that up. Yes? Yeah, I thought so. So over here, they're waiting for water and wheat. Someone's working on it. But now I have dwarves coming down here. And you know what? There's meat over here. There's an outhouse. There's all kinds of stuff. We should be reclaiming this stuff. Got some more mountain lore for something. Oh, that rock just fell on your head. That seemed awful. Alright. Now. I'm curious. Oh, we can't get through yet. Not quite yet. So let's come and dig this out. We'll take out as much of that as possible, too. And that one, because it's sticking out. You know what they say about, you know, being the one nail sticking out? If you stick out, you're the one that gets hammered down. So this is just more coal. Nothing big. But it's useful. Okay, I believe that should open everything up. Oh! Hold on. You're being attacked. Get out of there. What are you doing? Ron? Oh, you are absolutely following orders. Okay. I canceled those orders. Now get out of there. Perhaps I should get everyone down here. Alright, everyone. I want you all to gather down here. And then we, we assault the spiders. Okay, you guys are going to be climbing up. That's good. Ron, you now have help. Ron, what are you doing? Where are you going? Ron, come assault the spiders. You were so gung-ho about it before. All right, never mind. A curial and unicorn, it's all on you then. That's one dead spider. And, you know, kind of a big spider too. I thought that all the spiders were going to be little. Guess not. All right, get in there. Bust this place up. Wait, Gund is... No, never mind. You guys are fine. Alright, here comes the cavalry. Except for Ron. I don't know what he's doing. But get in there, deal with the spiders. Get him! Good job. And there goes the Tangled Hollow. We collapsed it. And we got mystery meat. We do still need to get up there and get all that, that coal and, and sapphires and everything else. Because there's so much up there. They were not kidding when they said the mother load. Do we have room for it, though? How's the storage going? Oh, the storage is absolutely full. Mm, with iron. Mostly. And rat meat. And coal. 
and just stuff in general. It's just all full. All right, well, you know what? That was still good. And I am running long on time, so I'm going to have to wrap this up here pretty quick. But we did get a lot accomplished. We got, or we resupplied ourselves on iron. We built a great hall that is still amazing. <gasps> I love it so much. We got alcohol. So that's fantastic. We have mine carts, even though I don't know how they work. So, like, this thing shows a minecart there, but I don't know how I lay down track. Because this is an elevator rail. And then this is a long elevator rail. Which I'm guessing I just put on top of here like this. Except no one can reach it. Perhaps I need to put stairs over here next to it. Kind of seems to, de uh, to defeat the purpose, but maybe. So i tell you what I'm going to do. I'm going to go ahead, I'm going to take a break, and between episodes, I'm going to extend this elevator shaft all the way up until I reach the uh, storage level up here. And if I have to make um, a scaffold or something that goes along with it, I will. And then after that, I guess we will try and figure out how it works. Because, again, nothing here seems to say tracks. I ain't no bridges or anything like that. Just, yeah, it says, un or wait, it says railway, but that's just the carts. And see, there's a cart. We have a cart. But... It's not going to go anywhere, because there's no railway, as far as I can tell. I don't get it. I'll figure it out, though. Because if we're going to have a, a functioning dwarven colony, we're going to need to uh, to take care of this. Or we're going to need railways. All right, we're dwarves. It's a mine. We need to have mine carts. I mean, Minecraft has mine carts. Terraria has mine carts. Everyone has mine carts. We need to... Too. So that being said, if you're if you'd like to help me figure this stuff out, if you'd like to be a part of our mountain home, just like comment down below and just like Ron, I will put you in here, whether you like it or not. Well, no, I'd rather you liked it. And if you really didn't want to, I'd take you back out. But please, Ron, I can't pronounce half of these names. Help me. If you just like what I'm doing and you think that I could be doing something better, also let me know that. Like, if you know how these minecarts work, tell me. Because I don't. And I'm probably going to take, like, three days to figure it out. Otherwise, if you're just having fun watching, make sure you subscribe so you, you know every time a new video comes out. And these are coming out every day. So it's not a matter of when or if, but just when. And not even what day, just what time. And if you know someone else who might want to be a dwarf, share it with them. The more people share, the more dwarves I get to rename. And that makes me happy. So, make me happy, and I will see you all back here next time for more Hammer Tank. And until then, take care.